All right, it is time for Money Smart. Joining us now is financial expert MJ Harris. Good to see you, MJ. Good to see you both. Thank you. Okay, so uh, KTLA viewer Tammy from Hawthorne wrote that uh, she's having anxiety as the holiday spending season approaches. Each year, right after Thanksgiving dinner, her family starts planning those Black Friday shopping bonanzas. I'm sure we'll be live from one of those or a lot of those. Now, sometimes her family spends as much as two grand. She says she always has buyer's remorse and stresses about paying off all the debt. What can she do to break this cycle of spending without being the party pooper? You know what? <laughs> I have to go. say this. I have to say this. You know, I've had, I have a video out. Over 50 million people have seen this video. It's called Don't Go Broke Trying to Impress People. Uh -huh. That is a mandate when it comes to holiday spending. Don't go broke trying to impress people. The bottom line is that, um, we all have budgets, very finite budgets. And when we spend trying to impress other people or trying to get approved from other people, we set ourselves in a situation where we can create financial duress for ourselves. So my advice to her is to think about herself first. I think that if she has children, she needs to talk to her children. This is what my mother would do with us. She'd say, this is how much money I have to spend this year. This is how much I've allocated to each child. Hmm. When you tell me what gifts you want, make sure it fits within that. So she put the onus on us to recognize that yeah. money is finite. And then we can make choices for ourselves around what we want. It. It's interesting because, um, you know, a lot of times you think you don't have to talk about things like that with your family because you might be embarrassed about it mm -hmm. or you want to provide for your kids. But she actually taught you a lesson in a great way. She really did. And I say talk to your children about it. You know, um, this viewer has other relatives, you know, maybe sisters and brothers who she's spending money with, you know, who's buying gifts for their own children. Mm -hmm. She doesn't need to talk to them about it. I say talk to your children because those, those are the folks who are going to be impacted by your different spending choices. Well, obviously, you know, you're a prime example. Example, it certainly uh, you know, paid off because look what you do for a living. Absolutely. My mother, we didn't have much money at all growing up, but by her being so transparent with us about her own financial limitations, it set the fire inside of me to be able to say, you know what, I don't want any limitations. Oh. And I created this life for myself. Yeah. I mean, and that uh, very expensive sports coat he's and wearing. Doing well. <laughs> and doing, doing well. And doing you know, well. He's doing well. Yeah. So do you set up? budget during the holidays? I do. I do. I recommend it to everybody, especially if you're buying from multiple people. Set the budget. Um, like I said, for your kids, communicate the budget to them, especially if they're old enough to understand that, um, and stay within that budget. The last thing you want to do is put yourself in debt right before the new year. What about friends and if you want to buy for co-workers and friends and boyfriend or girlfriend or husband and wife. Is that another thing you're clear with? I am the king of gift cards. I will get you oh, a gift card okay. to a fabulous store and that's, there you, there you go. Enjoy yeah. it. Make it work. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so let me ask you this. Do you, so do you say to your mom, okay, mom, I got this much money. Like <laughs> no, no, no. I go crazy my mom. I took her on a Hawaiian vacation when she turned 60. Oh, no expense was spared. Awesome. I mean, my mother created this, so she yeah. gets full access. Well, thanks for the tips. I know it's a sort of a stressful time because uh, money seems to flow out of the bank with Absolutely. travel and everything Absolutely. else. Absolutely. Thanks for raising the bar on the rest All of All right. Us. Thank you. <laughs>